the most prestigious club competition in European football. And now it comes down to this, the final itself. Who will prevail? It's Liverpool and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. It is Liverpool facing Barcelona. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium, and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? Oh, he's given it away. And this is how Liverpool will line up. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Mark and Peter Stegen starts in goal. Frenkie de Jong plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And the starting role on attack today is handed to Robert Lewandowski. position that's a useful cross and well positioned to clear well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance superb defensive judgment to end the attack Barcelona's turn now. Nice looking pass. Top class defending. De Jong. Joao Cancelo Frankie de Jong Joao Cancelo moving the ball more than decently but can they take the lead oh goodness me off the post it was an attack of promise but they couldn't take advantage of the situation well I have to say Barcelona is so unlucky not to be leading now they look a real threat at the moment. Romeo. Going well. And there's the feed into the box. Well, they survived the attack. Given it away. Wasted possession again. De Jong. Back to Lewandowski. Can he finish? Oh, in it goes. The opening goal in the UEFA Champions League final. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. And then the finish from Felix was never in doubt. He's such a good technician. And a Liverpool restart the game. A wake-up call for them, perhaps. Gakpo. Alexander-Arnold. Really good challenge. 
Felix. Now with the young. And taken away from Salah. Salah. A fine block. Joao Felix. And I must say, no shortage of space for Barcelona. Can he finish? Oh, he's put it just a fraction wide of the post. Andrew Robertson. And fed forwards. Real chance. There's the chip. Denied by the ball. Back in play here. And eventually into the grateful grasp of the keeper. Well, that could have gone anywhere once it hit the woodwork, but they've got away with it here. Well, Liverpool can't believe they're not level here, but they are looking dangerous now. Committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw in. Joao Felix. Crossing opportunity. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. Frankie de Jong, Christensen, and a throw coming up after that authoritative challenge. Barcelona. Well, it was the wrong throw in. Strength and control, a big part of his game. Oh, a really untidy loss of possession. Robertson. The electronic board showing one additional minute. Oh, he's going to be rightly proud of that moment. Sensational. Well, just look at this piece of skill. He times this absolutely perfectly. Great connection as well. We'll see this for years to come. Fantastic goal. terms here. Well, there we have it. We're at the halfway mark now, here at Wembley.
Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Nice ball to switch the point of attack. How about the cross? And a throw in for Liverpool. It's a perfect challenge. Joao Felix. And the referee has given the advantage to Barca. They were playing fluent football, but then the foul, and now you would anticipate a yellow card. Well, the referee saw it as a bookable offence. I think he's got it absolutely right. That was a poor challenge, you have to say. And Liverpool have the ball again. Good-looking ball. Oh, it's in! They take the lead here! And just how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, as the replay shows, it all started with that perfectly weighted ball over the top of the back line. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Just look at his reaction. That could prove to be a massive goal for his team. Well, two what it is here. Frankie Dio. Romeo. Lewandowski. Onto Dio. Joao Felix shielding the ball superbly. Barca maintain possession, advantage. Chances are. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Promising pass. Decent position for Liverpool to be in. Fine cross into the middle. Attending to his defensive chores. Robertson. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. So half an hour remaining. Salah Well they might be able to launch a counter attack Frankie De Jong Here's Rafinha Well read to ease the pressure He's pleasing his man Barcelona winning the ball back. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Speculative effort. Oh, so close to extending their lead. Well, that really would have put them in a commanding position, but it's still all to play for here. Well, you have to feel sorry for Jurgen Klopp. That should certainly have put them in control of this game.
what a piece of defending we've just witnessed. Well, that's a living, breathing example of positional sense. Well, no surprise there. Barcelona have enjoyed most of the possession, but it means nothing unless they start to be more creative, particularly in the wide areas. Up to this point, they've been too easy to defend against. Nunez. Barca regaining possession. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. De Jong. Good work from Liverpool to win it back. Oh, tremendous vision. Mo Salah. How can he take them on and beat them? Trying to chisel a chance out of it. Textbook defending inside the box. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Well, the fans are certainly having their say. Just listen to them. They thought that was a penalty. And a fine cross. A decisive clearance it was. Now counter-attacking possibilities. And finally up a cul-de-sac. Advantage Barcelona. It's a fine piece of attacking play from Lewandowski. And he has teammates to give it to. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. So Bosloy. Van Dijk with it. Luis Diaz. And he takes it away. Gundogan. Joao Cancelo. Being pressed here. The free kick decision goes the way of Barcelona. Well, he let them go on, but now he's going to deal with the yellow card situation. Yeah, and he was always going to be booked for that challenge. It was a poor one, you have to say. Well, this match ebbing away, but not quite in the books just yet. Liverpool desperately want the win. Stuart, interested in your critique of their performance? Well, they've certainly controlled the tempo of the game and just about deserve their lead but they've got to keep their concentration right to the end here. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left, and the margin just one. Christensen. Now with De Jong. Gundogan. Here's Rafinha. Lewandowski. Given the circumstances, Barcelona have got to go for it. Time is against them here. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Really annoying for them. Couldn't take advantage. Joao Cancelo. So two minutes of stoppage time here. Difficult to stop him. Gundogan. Let's see about the cross. Oh, he couldn't have with the keeper. Time really is of the essence. What can they do from this situation? Now well, far from the ideal header. And the goal. How about this? England's most successful European club have done it again. Liverpool, the winners of the Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great thing. What an achievement for them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy.
Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The kings of European club football, Liverpool. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe. 